We welcome you from WEDF NXT for National E-Wrestling Day 4. My name is Joshua Bishop. I'm honored to be here with such great organizations and great talent all around to make this day the best it can be for you, the fans. We'd like to thank our friends at the Armbar Era Society for allowing us to be here tonight and host this championship matchup. Let's not keep you waiting, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get this underway. The following contest is scheduled for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. And it is for the NXT Championship. Introducing the challenger. From Nashville, Tennessee, weighing in at 197 pounds, the mayor of the violence party, Molly Brown. And this man has been touted as one of the future leaders here in WEDF. This man has already made his presence felt in NXT. He's got a big victory to his name against Tyler Breeze from a rival, and he's earned his championship match he's here tonight against the man who is arguably the best wrestler in the world going today, the NXT champion, Sami Zayn. And Malik Brown, ladies and gentlemen, looks primed for the moment. You know this is what he's wanted. Malik Brown has been fighting for years to make a scratch on the WBF roster, and he's finally found his way into NXT. He's looking to win this NXT championship here tonight and show the world that the mayor of the violence party is for real. But he's going to have a tough task doing that here tonight against this man fixing to come out, our NXT champion, Sami Zayn. And his opponent, from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 205 pounds, he is the reigning and defending NXT champion, Sami Zayn. And Sami Zayn has proven his worth, ladies and gentlemen. In the main event of Arrival, this man defeated Ben Taylor to win the NXT Championship you see him wearing right now. He has had a penchant for breathtaking, death-defying moments here in NXT. He's proven himself to be one of the most exciting talents on the roster, and when he wins, he wins big. He's proven himself as the best wrestler in the world, and he's facing one of the best athletes here. These two men showing how much they respect each other. I love the sportsmanship. Upholding the code of honor between these two men. Absolutely incredible. But tonight, it's not about respect. It's not about honor. It's not about pride. It's about that right there. The NXT Championship. And they know what that could mean for their future. These two men looking to become the next breakout WEDF superstar and be the next John Cena or the next Danny Jackpot. Either way it goes, let's get into this match as it's underway. The champion looking to make his first successful defense. The challenger looking to ruin the inaugural champion's celebration. Sami Zayn now into the side headlock. Maintaining control over Malik Brown. Impressive movements early to throw off the challenger, but Malik Brown seems unfazed. Able to fight his way out, but no, Sami Zayn still maintaining control, but Malik Brown with beautiful lateral movements, able to slip his way out of Sami Zayn's grasp and say, come on, show me what you got. Things are already getting exciting between these two men as we go again into the collar and elbow tie-up. Malik Brown now taking the advantage into the wrist lock and holding it, and there you see the side headlock. Malik Brown showing Sami Zayn he can go hold for hold if he wants to. A beautiful display of textbook chain wrestling we're seeing here as now Sami Zayn regains the advantage. Now into the waist lock. No, Malik Brown able to regain the advantage. No, Sami Zayn able to escape and say, I got one up on you. Back on even footing as these fans here are in excitement. They can feel the tensions already. They know how much it means for these two men to be fighting for the richest prize in NXT as now we see Sami Zayn regaining the advantage. Now Malik Brown with the front neck lock. No, he misses Wild with the knee as Sami Zayn goes into the Irish whip, leaps over and leaps over again. No, Malik Brown able to get the counter with the famous surf. 
Senior her official Zach Cannon looks on as Malik Brown delivers a beautiful snap suplex. The mayor of the violence party looking to build some momentum and build on his brand of ghetto strong style. Smash mouth in your face wrestling that Malik Brown is well known for so far. Malik Brown now putting him down and feeling the momentum on the second row. Bouncing off and jumping right on Sami Zayn's back. Crushing him with all the momentum and the weight. And now Malik hooks the leg. Oh my goodness. Already getting dangerous with a beautiful exploder suplex. But it's only good for two. Malik Brown now again into the exploder. Showing off the athleticism. He may only be a buck 97, but do not be deceived by this man's strength and his athleticism as he gets the Tope Atomico into the cover. Only still good for two. And now Malik Brown slips behind. Malik Brown is looking for that full Nelson face buster. The one he used to set up Delwak Omega. But Sami Zayn able to fight his way out and bring the man down with the drop kick. The NXT champion regains the momentum as he brings him down with the calf kick. Sami Zayn now showing off the athleticism of his own into the leg Larry. Malik Brown looks dazed. He's he's grasping, he's gasping for air, not getting any grasp of momentum as Sami Zayn could deliver another calf kick and there's another drop kick. Ladies and gentlemen, excuse me if I can't speak straight, but I get so excited watching these two men in action. The drops up from Sami Zayn now into the Mafia kick. Malik Brown still able to get on his feet, showing the toughness this man has as Sami Zayn taking the fight to Malik Brown early. Lifting him up and dropping him for the stun gun. Shades of stunning Steve Austin, and now you see the standing moonsault. Beautiful athleticism as he goes into the cover. Two, he's got him, no he doesn't. Malik Brown is able to get his shoulder up, showing it's gonna take more than that to finish him. Deathlift German from Sami Zayn, and now Sami Zayn transitions into the camel clutch. Malik Brown looks to be in trouble early as Sami Zayn is quick to make the challenger humble. Malik Brown in trouble as senior official Zach Cannon continues to ask Malik Brown if he wants to tap. And Malik continues to say no. Malik continues to fight. And Malik able to get his footing and bringing down Sami Zayn with a beautiful slam into the cover. One, no. Maybe one and a half there, but definitely not enough as Malik continues to trade shots, say, you wanna fight, you wanna scrap with me? I got you. here you go. Malik Brown, one of the best strikers on the roster here as he brings Sami Zayn down with quick forearm shots. And now letting his presence be felt with more kicks, another fist drop. Malik Brown got him by the hair. What is he thinking here? Putting him in the corner. He could be looking to start a violence party. Throwing the two shot, Sami Zayn days. No, Sami Zayn slips his way out. And now Sami Zayn quick to trade the knife edge chop. But no, Malik Brown able to fight his way out. Misses Wild with the drop kick. And Sami Zayn bringing him down with another drop salt. Sami Zayn following up with another drop kick. The NXT champion into the cover. One, two, no. Malik Brown again able to get the shoulder up. Side headlock from Sami, another deadlift German suplex. And Sami Zayn kicking him over on his side, positioning him for something big. What could Sami Zayn be thinking here? Sami going up high. Sami going up to the top rope. Sami going for it all and nothing as Malik Brown slips out of the way. And Malik taking the cover, using Sami's own momentum against him, but only good for two is now Malik into the side headlock of his own, throwing some hard kicks. Now Malik into the European uppercut. Sami is dazed as here we go. He's got him hooked and he sends him flying with a half Nelson suplex. Malik Brown feeling the momentum as he puts Sami Zayn where he wants him. Leaps to the outside, no! Sami Zayn catches Malik Brown, much like he caught Finn Taylor slipping, and now Sami Zayn with the Frankensteiner! My God, into the cover! Two, no! 
Malik Brown at two and a half stays alive. And now the blue thunder bomb from the champion. This could already be over. Sami Zayn feeling the energy of the crowd. Telling him, come on, let's finish this together. He's looking for something big here against Malik. Lifts him up. What does he know? Malik Brown slips out. And now a backbreaker from the challenger. Malik Brown looking to take advantage and he's signaling for the end of his own. What is Malik Brown looking for here? Malik lifts him up, Splash Mountain! That sit down power bomb from Malik into the cover. This could do it too, new champ, no! Malik Brown is, he's, he's, I don't know how to feel from that. I thought he had it with that Splash Mountain and Malik thought so too. He's showing the frustration, the anger, and he's setting up for something big here, but Sami Zayn taking advantage of Malik's own momentum to send him over, and now Sami Zayn through the cross into the wind with that beautiful cross body. My God! These fans on their feet here as Sami Zayn taking the fight right to Malik Brown. Sammy now with the hard rights bringing down the challenger. Malik Brown comes stumbling out. Sammy Zayn, Irish whip into the corner, trying to get Malik Brown in the ring. The count is at six. Sammy Zayn needs to hurry, and he gets back in the ring. He now has Malik Brown right where he wants him. Irish whip into the corner. Sammy Zayn, he's got Malik hooked, and there's a tornado DDT. This could do it! Cover! One, two, three, no! Malik Brown gets the shoulder up, and now Sammy continuing to strike. Meechin Oku driver, legs hooked. One, two, three, no! Again, but wait a minute, Sammy tried for something there, but Malik caught him with the sling blade. Into the collar. One, two, three, no! Back and forth they go, and wait a minute, Malik's got him hooked, full house and face buster, full house and face buster, and Malik taking a minute to shake off the rust, and now he's got the get off Omega, get off Omega, is it? No, he doesn't, Sami Zayn is able to slip his way out, didn't have it fully hooked, and now Sami throwing him in the corner, he's thinking of the halluva kick, Sami, here he goes, no, Malik sees it coming, and now Malik, Signaling for the end, thinking it's time. The Jaguar knee, he's lining up. Sami Zayn gets to his feet. There it is. What the fuck? Swift death. You gotta be kidding me. Is Sami about to do this again? Iris whip in the corner. Haluba kick. Haluba kick. It hits. It's gotta be. One, two, three. Wow. He does it again! Here is your winner, and still NXT Champion, Sammy Zayn! You have got to be kidding me! Sammy Zayn, the magician, does it again! In the clutch! The NXT Champion retains his title, and I'm sure his friend, his ally, Cesaro, was watching this match. Look at this! He runs at him with the tag party, but Sami Zayn with the Swiss death, and then the Haluba kick. What a combination! What a win! My God! And Sami Zayn going over to his opponent. Extending the hand, you definitely love to see this. Shaking hands once again, Malik Brown knows he gave it his all, but in the end, it wasn't good enough to beat a phenomenal Sami Zayn on a huge wave of momentum. Thank you for letting us be here, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy the rest of your day. Good night.